Good evening, welcome to a business news segment. My name is Moik Peterson. Let's start here. Remgro, the Stellenbosch based investment firm, reported a 20% drop in earnings for the year ending June 30, 2024. Now, despite this downturn, the company announced a 10% increase in its ordinary dividend to 264 cents per share. Headline earnings per share fell by 18.8% to 1,018 cents. Additionally, the firm attributed its challenging financial year to ongoing efforts in finalizing and integrating significant corporate changes. Investment analyst Sitem Bilabupila provides further insights on Remgro's performance. Remgro released a downbeat set of results with a negative share price response down just under 5% uh, after the results, highlighting a mixed operational performance across the group's investing companies, as well as certain negative impacts from corporate actions that were carried out from the group um, or some of the investing companies within the group over the past couple of years. These corporate actions also impacted the comparability of headline earnings growth, but even when excluding these impacts, uh, the bottom line or headline earnings was still down 14% year on year, which was disappointing, but more or less in line with, with what the market had anticipated. The group reported an increased loss contribution from Heineken, which was mainly due to a challenging operating environment with tighter economic conditions placing downward pressure on consumers' disposable spending. The weak performance from CIVH, which comprises the group's telecommunications and IT assets, including Vumatel and Dark Fiber Africa, that performance was also discouraging, particularly as the market continues to monitor the deal with Vodacom, although the regulatory environment does remain quite restrictive uh, there. Overall, though, the diversified nature of Remgro's portfolio was supportive, with the underlying performance of the group's other portfolio companies remaining resilient uh, despite prevailing macroeconomic challenges.